This video contains analysis of a first-person shooter that has been rated M for mature. Thrusting allowing you to catch up to an enemy, evade a min- in Hey, learners, Jared here, and I am so excited about this next video because I am analyzing one of my absolute favorite things. We are going to look at the physics of the Halo 5 multiplayer beta. Now we're going to look at everything that I was able to analyze with video of the game. Now I must stress that I had a lot of help with this, with students of mine analyzing the data and helping me collect the data. And let me just say, it is really difficult to collect data in a game when there are four people playing it trying to kill you the whole time. When the Spartan 4 is just jogging, you are going about 8.4 meters per second, which is about 18.8 miles per hour. Once you hit the sprint, you are going 11 meters per second, which is about 24.6 miles per hour. Then with the thrust, you increase your velocity from sprint to about 16 meters per second. This is 35.8 miles per hour. And what I was most interested to see is what kind of acceleration does the player experience during this thrust? And I analyzed the velocity versus time graph, and we know that the slope of a velocity versus time graph tells us the acceleration. And I got about 78 meters per second squared. This is almost 8 Gs of acceleration. Here's what 8 Gs of acceleration does to normal humans. Let's your legs, up we go. I was also able to analyze the speed at which a grenade is thrown, which is about 30 meters per second or around 67 miles per hour. I was also able to analyze about what gravity they are using based on known distances in the game from distance data given in the game. You are given distance data to various power weapons or if you use your smart scope and the battle rifle, it tells you distances to not only enemies but friendlies which was handy because I couldn't get anybody on the other team to ever help me with this experiment. I don't know why. Get those nerds! Nerd! Nerd! Analyzing falling of this guy, I was able to get a gravity very near Earth. Now, it's a little lower than what it should be because this person is falling away from me, so their fall rate is changing relative to my perspective. And you can see this with these grenade throws from a first person point of view. The position graph is off. I should cover the most position there towards the end when my speed has increased, but the exact opposite happens because I am watching it fall away from me. Now, I was also able to analyze the SMG fire rate, which is about 15 rounds per second. It's a little more than 15. And strangely enough, the assault rifle was about half of that, 7.5 rounds per second on the dot. So is that by design that the SMG fires twice as fast as the assault rifle? Does that mean that its bullets are twice as weak? No! Thank you so much for watching. I hope you learned something about, if not anything else, how much I love Halo. And as always, keep learning. Game over. Victory.